My name is Amanda and this is my aha moment. I grew up here in Lubbock and then had opportunities to travel throughout the U.S. and work with a lot of different nonprofits, and, and then took the opportunity to join the Peace Corps. Peace Corps sent me to South Africa where I lived in a small village called Mama Tlake. Working with a couple of the nonprofits that I was working with in this village, um, we started a camp for the pri primary school kids, for the elementary aged kids, um, and it was just it, it was a camp like so many kids go to here, just a day camp where they go and they play games and they have activities and they learn some lessons. After that week, and even I've got, gotten to go back and visit a couple of times, you still see kids walking around with the t-shirts that they painted from those weeks. And you know that that changed their lives. And we didn't do a whole lot. We didn't bring in a whole lot. We didn't spend a whole lot of money. Um, and it was mostly run by the people in that community with a little support from me. And it changed. It changed changed their community, changed their lives. It was the community interacting and, and making an impact on those kids. And what I've brought back to my hometown is that the most important thing is that a community takes care of a community. Um, when, when the community isn't doing a very good job at it, the community isn't thriving. There's no one government, there's no one Nonprofit. There's no one church. There's no one faith-based organization of any kind that can really take care of a community that we all have to do, be doing our part. The Lubbock community that I want my daughter to grow up in is one that takes care of that, and that's important for me to instill in her is what being being serving and being involved in the things that she's passionate about and caring for her neighbors and caring for the people around her.